Hello guys, welcome to today's video by Trust and Leon. This is a TS Tech Talk video guys. So on today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to manage your page after you have created them or probably how to edit your page after creation on your PC. So guys, um, if you want to do this on mobile, I already created a video on mobile and it's on the same playlist. So you can check out the playlist of my Facebook page to see every um, video I have created for Facebook page. So for today's tutorial this is what i'm going to show you guys how to do on pc so go ahead and open your facebook application and you notice where it has the pages um link or category click on pages wait for it to load it won't take much time but depending on your device it might take time so go ahead and select the exact page um for my case i'm going to choose cotton candy i just clicked on those three dotted icon to display more option and now this is cotton candy now i can select that particular page and wait for it to load now um this is quite different from mobile page now you can notice um i have the name i have um the username and then that is already set and if you want to further edit this um this actually is the play button probably you want to change the link that people click on to play the game or maybe the download link you can click on edit section and then you notice it says edit so you can go ahead and do edit or you do delete whichever one you want to do um but that's not what i want to show you guys what how to do today but this is part of it anyway so guys how to manage your page right there you notice on this left hand corner there are several options right there and when you scroll down a little bit you can notice where it says settings edit page and page quality now this actually does different thing i've made different videos regarding this stuff so after creating your page you want to manage it um on default it displays this option where it asks you to select all of this stuff and once you finish it this strength or this rank or radar is going to complete 100 percent but right now is seven out of 13 but most of them i don't need to complete them because they are not necessary for this page so the first thing to do after creating your page is to go over to the page info so from the page info you can do a lot of changes um from changing the name of your page to the username to the description of the page you notice i added a little description and then to the category and then even more things email phone number and every other basic detail that your website actually include you can see everything right here now um the reason why i'm not going through all of this is because i've gone through them before so this is actually the first place you come to after creating your facebook page now the next place you come to is your settings when you come over to your setting you have similar information also now um, right here you can notice the page is actually published if you click on this section you can either unpublish the page so that you want to make some changes or you want to edit some things on the page unpublish it edit whatever you want to edit and then publish whenever you want to and then the public visitor there are several informations right here you can go ahead and look through if i'm going through each of them one after the other it's going to take even more time and then guys if for some reason you want to um go ahead and delete your page this is actually the information so guys go ahead and go through all of this information to see anything you want to do and then guys um there is also an um an page info right here and then a page template these two actually does different thing and they are not displayed right here so all of this area actually displays different section um under the um, settings area you can notice there are different things now let me explain this information this information is very similar to the one we clicked on previously let me click on it so that you guys will see you notice it's still similar right now um all of this information we are actually visible because we clicked on the settings if we didn't click on the settings all of this um detail all of this tab are not going to display so the next area is your template section your template actually allows you to change your template arrange the order and then enable and disable some features on your um on your facebook page so guys um that is what the template does i'm going to cover this template on a different chapter because there are something i need to actually discuss so the notification section is actually for you to enable the notification and all of those things advanced messaging is for you to enable um auto reply messages and all of that and probably automatically delete some messages that violate so all of these i have already covered most of them and the one that i did not cover i'm actually going to take time and cover all of them so after creating your facebook page for the first time two places you need to go the settings and the edit page so i mean the edit info so that is actually where you need to come 
to edit your page properly and all of these other information are also added under the general settings section so let's say we went back to the home page of the um of our facebook click on the pages um go back to the cotton candy i just want to show you guys something real quick you notice on this left hand area it's not displaying um the uh the templates the page um the page info this is actually the page info and some other thing the other uh, message section but once you click on the setting section it displays all of this so this is actually where you need to come to to edit anything on your facebook page so guys this is all i want to show you every other thing i already covered them on previous video and then you can check out my playlist to watch them so thank you for watching this video um i hope it's helpful if it is much like subscribe to the channel i will see you guys on my next video please stay safe and peace